right here. This is one of the few places on the island where the water flows freely from the mountain to the sea like it's supposed to, right? And this valley obviously is very verdant and it has water. And so we're here planting food, claiming that water. 600 ulu trees, 500 coconut trees, and some call opening up some patches. We're here preparing for our future. I hate picking my nose after that. You got all the aina in your nose, bro. You know what I mean? Yes. We go to the pool, boy. I went already. What? I just want to go look. I'm gonna go jump in. So he's all the way up there, but I don't know if we want to wait for him to come down. <laughs> I mean, like, it's way up there. Footage of the music. But definitely, see? All the Ulu. So this is the work you've been doing today. Yeah, I can take you to my ulu that I planted with my family. It's a really small baby ulu. <laughs> That's a wiry little root. <laughs> to the car, I got there and I didn't have the keys. <laughs> Okay. From Kauai. Oh, I got. Did you guys give baby Ulus like 10 years ago or whatever? Yeah, we're getting Ulus from Kauai. Yes! I got one. So here's a And mine is big. Right. At my house. And I got a baby Keiki from that Kauai. Ulu, right, right. And that's what I planted here. Oh my gosh! <laughs> yours are Kauai. Oh, my, oh gosh. my gosh. Thank you. Oh, guys. at least we know it worked. Oh, oh all over. Huh? Six, eight, Yeah, we are heading back to Punalu. And then text me your name. You hear my voice? I'm an animal that got the battery already. Before when I was young, I was uh, drinking, uh, drinking beer, snorting cocaine, my limes, drugs, liquor, and fornicating out of wedlock. Let me tell you people here, give it up, because the piper got to be paid. And the piper is knocking on my door. Plus, I just got on bill for my freaking knee doctor. He mad. Why I don't pay? Because that knee still broke. <laughs> I think he's going to say that the police pretty soon. Okay, okay. I don't know what to say. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. okay. This is my last song. I see everybody gotta go someplace for me too. Makafa ho ho ho, the village is all run deep. Before the fall of God and the slaughtering of the sheep. I want to hold my cold where the heavens touch the sea. Now poor cows smell like me. Yes, they do. I'll do the book of the it's about me. Oh, back in them days it was the cool guy and the fly. He prepared for the signified jive. I tell you, rumble in the jungle, salvation just arrived. Redemption for you, jungle bunnies, my boy, honey, you know, call on I. Well, you Pacific Ocean monkeys, better than you've been before. Praise glory, the Lord of Ilikia, Captain Cook, step to shore. Oh, why you, who, who, number, number, okay, here you got the Democratic Party. But why is up here? Who they working for must be corruption cause 
Stop, Kyle, I'll give you some knuckles, sir. Uh, where you want to go? Think more better, we go a little bit up there. Okay. Yeah. So first of all, I will tell you that this right here is how I know that life is what you make it and you can live any dream that you want. I've been listening to this uncle my whole life say, go clear the land, go plant boy. That's the solution, yeah. And today, uncle in his 70s is singing while we're clearing land, taking it back and planting food. Yeah, this fight that we're in is a multi-general fight, multi-generational fight backwards and a multi-generational fight forward. And we're fighting for the health and well-being of our kids that are not even here, not even born. The grandchildren of my children. Yeah, my 15 year old will depend on this. This may be a critical part of her evolution and it's not this orchard, it's the idea that it should be illegal to have land this fertile, surrounded with invasive trees in the state of Hawaii. Yeah, in the kingdom of Hawaii, this would never happen. Yeah, only in the mindless state of Hawaii do we find ourselves sitting on fertile land and waters and native peoples in need of food. Yeah, this is like one of those things, you got a freaking royal, a, a royal flush and, and then you're folding because you want the other guy to win. We need to make sure that our ability to just exist is possible. Yeah, and for us to exist, we need the ulu to exist. We need the coconut to exist. We need the kalo to exist. We need the fish in the ocean to exist. Because these are all our ancestors and our food source and the future food source of our descendants. It's, it's not a hard thing to, to visualize, to understand or want, but it's a difficult thing to do when you've been under occupation by the United States military for 130 years. Yeah. And so the fact that 130 years of US military occupation, we just figured out that we can go clear land and plant. So I would have to say that the veil has been ripped off and that the truth is how we live. And if these guys wanna fight us to plant food, I promise they will lose. Yeah, and the world will rise up. It has to start somewhere, yeah? But it has to start with us planting it. It has to start with us making a commitment to nurture it. You know what, this is awesome. Everyone calls this day one, but I've been in this bushes since Friday. We did this in three days with the police, with the DLNR, with mad kupunas. Like we've figured out a way through all odds to still make this happen, right? And, and we went about it in a completely, you know, if they say freedom of religion is apparent within the United States, well, I prayed. And Akua said, this is a year to plant. If you can figure out how to plant at the Capitol, Daniel, do it. But I couldn't, maybe I'm not that smart. But maybe also I'm realistic to say that we can't hold anything we plant at the Capitol. As opposed to Kahana, which has 31 of the most scrapping families in all of Oahu. And you know how they're scrapping? Because there was 2,000 families in here 100 years ago, you know, 150 years ago, down to the last of the last hammers. And so, these are the people that we can either burn them out by having them feel like they need to fight alone, yeah? Or we can identify with them and realize that their success will mean that we too have the chance to be successful. 
Because if the people on the land ain't making it, the guys without the land ain't got a fucking chance. And so the guys without the land got to help the guys on the land so that the circle can start. Yeah? We need to learn how to plant something for somebody without any expectations of anything in return. And we have to be willing to show up regularly and love that thing as if it was our child. <laughs> Never ever being able to eat, drink, or share any food with it. And when we're good with that, the world gonna be good. Get seven billion people, yeah? We plant two trees a year each and care and love them in that fashion. Gonna be only years before there's trillions of trees replanted. Oh, like Sorry. Comedy.